Hey guys, it's Anna Dolosky. Didn't realize that being an airhead is just part of being pregnant? I didn't either. That's right, there's a little bun in the oven happening here, but there's also some baby brain happening. Sure, your pregnancy hormones are having a bit of fun at your expense, which is what happens when you experience morning sickness, fatigue, and heartburn, to name a few. But some research indicates that there could be a change in brain activity that may answer some questions about baby brain. Research from the University of London suggests pregnant women show increased activity in the right side of the brain in an area associated with emotional skills. The findings suggest that during pregnancy, there are definitely changes in how the brain processes information and emotion all to prepare mothers to bond with their babies at birth. Yeah, sure, but it doesn't seem that way when you find your car keys in the refrigerator. I mean, not speaking from experience, of course. But those hormones aren't the only culprits. Pregnant women know very well that restful nights are few and far between. Lack of shut-eye can definitely affect your productivity and memory the next day. And never mind that your energy is completely zapped which your brain needs to stay focused. And to top it all off, your brain cell volume actually decreases during the third trimester of pregnancy. Great, our brains are slowly shrinking and we'll probably forget everything we just learned in this video. But you may ask, how do we fix this? Some science suggests loading up on omega-3s, which you should be doing anyway, is a good way to boost your memory. Salmon and walnuts are two foods that contain omega-3s. Another nutrient to lean on is choline. This essential nutrient helps improve brain function, and it's the building block for a memory-forming brain chemical called acetylcholine. Choline can be found in different meats, eggs, and peanuts. But probably the best advice I read was, find a way to laugh at yourself. Yeah, thanks, internet. My husband won't be laughing the next time I back into his truck, or forget to pay the power bill, or burn the house down. <laughs> Hey, it's all for a good cause, right? Don't worry, your brain and my brain will bounce back just a short few weeks after delivery. To see more stories like this, like us on Facebook, visit our website, acsh.org, and don't forget to subscribe to your latest dose of news delivered straight to your inbox. For The Council, I'm Anna Dolosky.